Your neighborhood do it best store is your best source for friendly service, expert advice, and innovative products like these. I'm with Todd from Seymour Midwest. Todd, you know, when people go to pick out their first shovel or a new shovel, there's a lot to consider. Help us know about uh, uh, what they should be looking for. Well, it depends on what they want. Um, if, they, if they want a shovel that's going to last a lifetime, then what I would choose is a Structron shovel. Um, I'm a firm believer you get what you pay for. You bet. So I'm going to pay a little bit money for something that's going to last me a lifetime. All right. Why don't we start at the handle end and, and work our way up? Well, the Structron shovel, number one, we start out with a double dip grip. It's a vinyl grip and we do a double dip nice and comfort to the touch. You're not going to get blisters. And, and one thing about fiberglass handles, they do have a tendency to, to fiber. Sure. So you want to protect your hands and, and we do that with that double dip vinyl grip. Awesome. And then I think here we can see actually what's going on inside uh, the shaft itself, right? Yeah, correct. Uh, what you want to look for is number one is the thick wall. A thick wall fiberglass handle is going to be something that's going to last l a lot longer. You don't you know, with the pressures you're putting on it, um, that's something that's going to hold up. Right. Then what we also do is we put a solid fiberglass insert in the handle, and then it actually extends all the way through the neck of the shovel. And basically, your weakest point on a shovel is going to be at your fulcrum here, where your handle meets your your head and handle meet. And this is where we're about to have a little physics lesson, aren't that's we? That's correct. C correct. What we do is we actually use a crimp collar on this particular product that actually crimps that steel to that fiberglass. Now, if we didn't have a solid fiberglass insert in there, that crimp would actually crush that fiberglass handle. Wow. So we, we do reinforce that. that. That insert's about 13, 13 and a half inches. So if you consider how it goes from the neck all the way in through the handle, we definitely reinforce that, that breakage point right there. And then what should we look for in, in the, uh, the business end as well? The business end of the shovel, obviously, this uh, is a Japanese steel. It's made exclusively for Seymour Midwest and our Structron brand. It's a spring steel, 14 gauge. It's one of those shovel blades that's not going to break. Typically, what you find in the marketplace is you'll find some uh, Chinese metal that's brittle, um, and you start to flex it, it'll break. This will not break, and it we you know we, we spend some money on it, but right. it's actually a good quality product, and it's something that's going to last for a lifetime. So this is the Structron brand. Structron brand, correct. From Seymour Midwest. From Seymour Midwest. This is just a sampling of the more than 67,000 items available from your friendly neighborhood Do It Best store. Check them out today.